Good morning, guys. Granny Potato's been up all night. I have already slept maybe like an hour or two. Uh, I was in the cleaning spree um, this week. And um, my van, I got it all set up last night. Well, the night before. Uh, well, the time I had it in the front where I put the water. Um, the big container water rain collector, okay? You know, that big blue bi um, container, 46 inches tall, and I don't know how wide, but it took uh, the whole back seat and top of the sink, uh, my DIY sink in the van. So it's in there, guys. Um... I put last night at wee hours. You know, you get out at wee hours thinking nobody's watching and there's always an eye. Well, anyway, I say God is good. <laughs> my prayers work, guys. My prayers do work. So, my daughter had picked up the laundry. I still have my suitcase that I went upstate New York. And I went to the Bahamas with that same suitcase and whatever is in there, it's in the van. So, that's what I used when I was upstate. In my brother's house except for extra you know pajamas and stuff like that well the temperatures up there are in their 50s uh 60s <laughs> Woo -hoo! so i knew i had to do something about that so, whoa no those clothes are not gonna get ada anywhere so my daughter brought the laundry bag back and I had an oversized, you know, carry bag, oversized, I'm talking about oversized. I said, you know what, I'm not even looking in the bag or sorting anything out. Pop! At 12.30 midnight, guys, I went outside with the bag, quietly, tuku, 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 it down to, around the corner to the van. I put it in the front floor of the front okay the front of the seats of the van um i said my cameras because i am going all the way this time i i got i got to do i got i gotta spare my mind up so i got my cameras batteries all charged up okay everything is charged up so i don't have to worry about it I downloaded some movies. Oh, I have tons of movies downloaded. But I keep doing it in case of an off-grid. I can work with my Jackery and my projector. Um, and I can watch some movies. So, I got a hard time downloading biblical movies because it's someone else who recorded a, the movies, okay? The biblical movies. And then they uploaded it, and the, 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 the picture is not clear, the voice is off the hook, um, it's a chaos, okay? So, whoever are doing that, get it right, <laughs> get it right. Well, the reason for that is, the original ones, Guys, we got so much violence and, 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 and all of that stuff and drugs and, and you name it on TV. For anyone to just click a button or right now I can click to anything and watch crime, violence, drugs, whatever the hell I want to watch. But with the biblical movies, guys, you have to pay. Buy or rent. What is going on? Buy or rent. So, and then if it's from YouTube, you can't purchase unless you have the program that I have. So I have two programs to download, but I could not download those. But I had to search, go through the other program, and boom, boom, I got them. I've been, I've been downloading practically the whole Bible um, on my laptop, you know, just to have it. Documentaries, uh, practically most of the stuff that comes from the Bible. You know, the story of Solomon, uh, the uh, story of David, um... Jesus of Nazareth, you know, the whole nine yards, okay? Even the Revelation, I have it. Uh, you know, because you can, instead of always reading, you can, you, can, you can listen and watch, okay? So, in off grid, just in case, I do have options. So, and family movies, Christmas movies, um, a couple of good things. Family for, for kids, 
Uh, I, I downloaded my favorite. I was not going to go to bed at 3 o'clock in the morning until I downloaded my Moana. Yes, I got to have my Moana. So, guys, uh, all my cameras are ready. My clothes are in the van. I'm going to have to park somewhere before I head out to maybe put the bin on top of the bed due to the fact that it's going to rain tonight or this afternoon because uh, uh, Fiona is going to come up um, east of the U.S. Not close, they say, but it's going to bring some rain. It's going to bring some rain uh, somewhere down the line. So I know I look already and it's going to rain in upstate New York. And, you know, Nova Scotia, Canada is, is, is cold. So I will, I will see some rain. <laughs> um, I don't know where the coast is. It's not far. Boston Beach. Let's see. Let's see, guys. We'll go anyway. Eight of, uh, 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 if I could drag my brother or my, daughter, or my sister-in-law because I don't know where I'm at when I am up there. Okay. So anyway. Um, it's about a three-hour ride. I am. Um, I haven't slept, guys. In oh, let me put this over here before I forget. I have not slept practically all night. Um, the night before either, because I was just busy cleaning the house, organizing stuff, getting rid of stuff, and you know how I did the cleaning behind the the, the TV and all that. I'm exhausted. Um, I renewed my membership from BJ's Wholesale Club because. Um, I cannot deal with this pale chicken at Walmart. I mean, yeah, Walmart. The pale, 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 pale like these walls of shrimps. Um, or the tilapia fish. Uh, you know, stuff like that. So, my daughter-in-law was here yesterday evening with my grandson. And he brought me a bunch of... Uh, acorns baby acorns a little teeny acorn and I, I think i saw something on one of you guys videos about the acorns these little teeny ones that you can they're edible or or seed or you can plant them or, or something i gotta go back to the video i totally forgot but he brought me a handful it was a handful and i swear i put him here or maybe he might have took him back i don't know you know how kids are and I said, hoo, hoo, I got to get back on that video to see about these little acorns. So, I only can find one. <laughs> but I've seen some laying around outside, so that's not, that's not a problem. Guys. So, oh, let me show you the oil I received the other day. Ah, yeah, 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 oh, wee. So, I got that safe. Uh, my van is, 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 all the liquids are okay, fine. Um, should be good. Um, I, this morning I was cleaning his mirror because it, it's just, it, it, it's, uh, my daughter gets to clean in a hot minute. I use those Mr. Dude's wipes and I did the job. After Windex, after soap and water, it was just smeared. By the time I got back it was dry and I couldn't do nothing with it. I'm not straining my neck or anything, so I said, let me try the dude wipes. Guys, do wipes clean the glass so I have um I, I had ordered some more for to have here and I have some in my van so before I head out I'm gonna kind of clean my my windows on the inside because um my van only gets washed in the rain <laughs> gold color is like it stays clean so anyway guys I'm gonna be headed out hopefully today so I left my other set of keys in my brother's house last time I was there so I don't have any house keys. Remember, I had to purchase a PO box, my well, my PO box. I have an order um, that I got an email two days ago that I received it. Right? I have to go pick that up. So I will show you on another video uh, what my orders were. I'm, I'm so stupid to go pick them up here. So I'll show them to you guys once I pick them up uh, on another video. Another video. So I got to get that done, get everything out of my P.O. box so my baby girl don't have no time to be running back and forth. She was so exhausted yesterday and she tore the something meniscus on her knee or something like that. So she was, she went to work with a knee brace. Um, I'll tell you, 
Uh, her job is not easy, but she doesn't complain. She stopped at a Walgreens and picked up a neon brace, and then today she's still rolling. So anyway, guys, the only thing I would have to take out of here, and what I will have to do again, okay, because I was just too tired yesterday, is put everything that I'm going to take last minute, like my camera bag and my laptop, uh, will be in my laundry bag, okay? And just walk out of here like it's laundry so I can get out of here. Otherwise, guys, it's not going to happen. Uh, Miss, Miss Nosy up there will know that Ada is not here, and then she'll start blowing my phone, and then she'll start uh, uh, watching out for my for whomever, and it'll be, I, don't, I just, I need a peace of mind. So that's the reason why I have to sneak out. Coming back, I don't care because I just come back and then I unload in the middle of the night. And uh, But getting out is an issue. That's one thing I don't like about because I'm one nosy person. So, guys, I hope that I can uh, bring the big one this time out there, okay, during my stay. I don't know how long I will stay. Hopefully... I won't have to come back because of something out here. I'm going to be mad as heck. Every time I leave, I got to rush back because something is going on. So, um, that's about it, guys. So, we're taking that container and going to do the legwork upstate New York because it's going to rain uh, today, this, after, this evening, and tomorrow. So, I'm going to try to head out of here before the rain comes. It, even if it rains, I am still heading out, guys. Um, it'll be at a slower pace because the GPS loses signal. Um, so <laughs> sometimes, um, you wind up where you don't want to wind up at because signal's gone, GPS is gone, and then it picks up again, and then it reroutes you, and you know how that is. So I always wind up in a different route because I don't know the route. I wish they would write it. You know what? They're going to have to write it down for me. Well, I'm going to look on the map and write it down myself because I can't deal with the situation. It takes me three hours sometimes. It took me five hours to get here last time. So, let's see. I'm going to try to go the same way I came back. Um, that's down that. I'll show you guys where there is nowhere to pull over. That's about my best bet. I don't know. Let's see. So, all my cameras are set. I charged all the batteries for, you know, on the way. And also, guys, because if I have to pull over somewhere and boondock for the night, I have, that's why I'm stopping before I leave, probably at Walmart. I'll stop at the parking lot, put the bin, that big uh, container, a rain catcher, in top of the bed. And if I have to sleep on the floor, guys, in between the, um, the uh, food three drawer, I still have space on the floor to lay stretch out. I'll have access to the sink, and I can use the porta potty if needed. I can cook something if I have to. Um, make coffee, hot chocolate, something, okay, if I have to. Um, it's easier, okay? I'll I can do it. Um, the way the container is sitting right now, I won't even, I'll have to jump in through um, the, the back, the, you know, the back of the van, the big, the big um, latch in the back. So I don't want to do that. So I'll stop at Walmart and I'll just put it on top of the bed. And if I get tired and sleepy, listen, I got pillows. I'll I'll, I'll sit on top of the, the seat uh, and, and just lean over <laughs> or lean back or lay on the floor and get me a good night. You know, whatever hours I need to continue the journey if it gets that bad. I don't want to get caught in a tornado out there because when it rains out there, you are prone to get stuck on a tornado. It doesn't fail. Um, tornadoes have a tendency to roll upstate New York, um, especially in that mountain area of no man's land, I call it. <laughs> uh, so, guys, um, I will be going to BJ's today with my daughter-in-law. Um, go to the post office, get all the stuff I have there, um, and... Get some shrimps. My daughter wanted me to bring her a bag of shrimps and some, some you know, since I renew the card. Um, and some tilapia, she said. And what the heck else she said. 
Heck, I forgot already. Oh, and when I leave, because I left my keys in upstate New York, my house keys and all of that, um, I told her if I leave, um, depending on the weather out here and whatnot, uh, I will text you. So I'll send you a text that I left, and I will put the house key inside the mailbox. So the mailbox has a, a key. Uh, she has it. I don't have it. Mine's are in upstate New York. So I'll make sure that I don't throw the key in there <laughs> as I'm leaving. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm screwed. Um, Miss B, she, she will be fine. Okay, she got all her snacks. She got all her... Well, she's more prepped than I am. Um, and she takes good care of her. So I don't have to worry about her. And uh, that's about it I have right now, guys. So let me show you my cameras that I had... Um, um, that I'm taking with me, and, um, let's see what happens, okay? Um, stay tuned, guys. Hold on. Hey, guys. I'm at, uh, BJ's right now. I got a deal. I found a deal for beans. Eight for $7.99. So, I got pink. I got pintos. Um, what else I got? I got some olive oil. This was $19.99. for the oil. Call holding for the tire department. 14 Four. something for Zero. One. my daughter's cucumber shampoo, body wash. And I got some vinegar for $2.99 since I, I got two big ones, guys. Look at this. Not bad. So for $7.99, guys. Um, I got the pink, the black, and the pintos. Not a bad deal. Not a bad deal, guys. Let's keep going.
not individually wrapped. ¿A dónde? I got uh, brown eggs, I got two, I got uh, six boxes of uh, the elbow spaghetti and panini, I got the white and cheater, um, strudels, strawberry strudels, french toast sticks for $10 and something, and this was $10 and something too for 72 waffles, um, and then the beans, the vinegar, and the soap, and the trims, and I got to get out of here because these prices are crazy. Um, even though it's a big wholesale, but I saved on the beans because at the corner bodegas, a dollar thirty-nine per can, and I got eight cans for seven ninety-nine. So that's a deal. Now I gotta get the water and get out of here. Oh, snacks. Okay, I gotta find Oreo cookies, guys. My daughter said Oreo cookies. Here we go. Oreos, where are you? Oreos. Okay, guys, I picked up some pork chops. I got three cases of three cases of water for five ninety nine. I got her shrimps. I got the potato bread. It's two in a pack, and I got a rotisserie chicken to leave. Because Ada ain't cooking today. Angie! Si vera Oreo, agaja un pack. Oh, sorry. So there it is, guys. My haul today before I head upstate. That way I can have a piece of more mind. Here. There you go, guys. So I gotta get out of here because we got shorts. So, what do you think, guys? Oh, and the oil. That's the version. I, I don't need a lot of pork, but I don't know. She'll figure something out. At least she'll have something at home. We got chicken. We got tilapia. Um, the flounder. And she got an extra bag of shrimps. And she got her air. Uh, her eggos here for on the run or when she come home hungry and, and mommy ain't home to cook and it's late so she could always snack on something all right guys i'm done i'm missing one item her audio cookies i don't know where the snacks are let's see if i can find it let's see if i can find her oreo cookies okay guys well, i'm exhausted i don't like coming into the store I like to order online and, and just pick it up, guys, because I can't deal with this cart. It's breaking my back already. Last time I did this, I was messed up for quite some time. So anyway, look at this. Animal crackers, hey, $9.99. But my grandson comes over, so I gotta have something, right? Oh, Jesus. Are we all cookies? Woo -hoo. No high fructose, co good. No high fructose, yeah. Guys, no high fructose. Oh my goodness, I got to get the heck up out of here. Angeli, where are you? My daughter-in-law's on a real shopping spree. Oh, I'm going to the counter. I'll wait for her. I'll wait for her up in the front, guys, because I can't deal with this. Guys, but you know what? The store is fully stocked over here, okay? This is BJ's Wholesale Club. But the prices are off the hook. Okay, regardless of a wholesale price, a place. Well, I had two boxes of Welch's at home. I don't know what happened to them. I hid it or did I hide them away? Yeah. 
I think I hid him away. I don't buy goldfishes or or Cheez-Its or none of that stuff because it has too much salt, guys. Too much salt. Okay. Too much salt. So I don't deal with none of that stuff. Let's see what else over here. See? Those uh, cheese cookies and white cheddar with all that salt on it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. All right, guys. Well, just to let you know that my titties coming out of my shirt, out of my, out of my bra. Oh, honey bunches and oats. Well, she got a heck of honey bunches and oats at home. Those little. I don't have any frosted flakes, but she got a heck of um. I'm taking my frosted flakes. But she got a heck of honey bunches and oats. And I don't have no frosted flakes. So I'm taking. I'm taking frosted flakes, guys. Ah. Oh. Yeah, she has tons of honey, but she got the little individual pockets. But I'm gonna take my. No, vamono, 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 Angie, vamono. Me duele la espalda. La tengo rota. Okay, I took my frosted flakes. I can't live without my frosted flakes. <laughs> she has boxes and boxes, guys, of, in of individual. Plus all of this stuff, because she's giving me money for that stuff. You think I'm doing all this groceries? Uh uh. Away. Okay, guys. Uh, uh, wait for me at the at the checkout counter. Okay, guys. I found um. Ooh, Daniel Steele. Oh, I have this one downloaded. Oh my goodness. I love Daniel Steele books. I had I used to have a collection. I know they have them here. Oh. Angie, mama no Angie. Let's go. Let's go. All right, guys. Ada is back home. Lord have mercy. I don't know where I'm going to put all this, guys. But I got to find a home for it. But I'm, some of the stuff I'm going to leave out here. So that my daughter can see what I brought. Because uh, half of this stuff is actually hers. Um, she likes the potato bread. <laughs> the potato bread. Um, my grandson has some uh, animal crackers. And when he comes, he got to munch on. My daughter got to have her Oreos, okay? But she ain't lost enough weight already. Um, she loves virgin olive oil. So this was uh, 10 bucks. So uh, what else? She got her cheddar. She got her French toast sticks. I got my frozen flakes. Yay! And um, three. The three. Um, uh, how many cans is uh, two, four, six, eight cans each, guys? Pink beans, Roman beans, and black beans. Yeah, black beans has a lot of fiber. And she loves white uh, rice with black beans. Um, they call it moro. That's what they call it, moro. She makes it really good. Um, I can semi-make it. Um, but people from Dominican Republic, they're the ones who know how to make it really good. I got the two um, gallons of white vinegar because I've seen on some of the um, my prepping people, uh, my prepping family, uh, they have white vinegar. Uh, it's, uh, it's good for a lot of things. So I decided to start buying it. Uh, thank God I got the, the half a gallon, guys. So I wasn't expecting a half a gallon, but I saw it for two ninety nine. I grabbed it. Um, waffles. Uh, what is down here? Oh, I forgot already. What? Oh, the, those those strudels. Strudels. Was it strudels, guys? What? What? What the heck? Um, yeah, those toaster strudels. They got. They go in the fridge. Um, the eggos go in the fridge. Guys, I got a big problem here. Okay, I got the eggs over there. Brown eggs because I was reading that brown eggs um are more healthier than the white eggs. Uh, look at that. It's just but Bella is stocked up, guys. Um oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, my frosted flakes will go in here. And the beans. I have a problem here. <laughs> Guys, I got a problem here. 
My daughter-in-law came yesterday. Guys, she brought me some food, and we were tearing it up. And look at this, guys. I mean, this is, this is, this is, uh, oh, my goodness. Uh, what am I going to do, guys? Where am I going to make space for all of this fridgey stuff? Okay. I don't know, guys, but it's gonna, it's, I'm going to make it happen. I am going to make it happen. Um, I already put the meat in the fridge. Okay. Yeah. Um. Uh, these are snacks, guys. These are snacks that I make for Bella. My daughter also does it for Bella. I don't know if you have to give your puppy snacks, but these are like little crumbly um, vitamins. Um, uh, let me show you the probiotics and stuff like that. You just sprinkle a little bit over, and then you fill it up with... Um, I use Pedialyte, okay? I give my puppy Pedialyte um, and um, vitamin water. Okay, uh, yeah, with a little bit of Pedialyte and make a mix and then just fill in. And then every day she'll get, a, you know, one or two. She loves them. So, guys, there's a bacon. There's about everything in here. Um, look at the chicken. I got the red meat, just a barbie. Here's her shrimps. Okay, so she got enough stuff there. She loves pierogies. Um, she loves this other pasta. Um whatever it is that is called um tortellinis yeah those are the tortellinis there's some more stuff back there guys she's got cauliflower rice this is these are bags and bags uh the bags are all the way piled up to here it's cauliflower rice guys she loves all of that stuff um broccoli uh this only when mommy's home okay cornmeal she don't know how to fix Unless mommy's home, okay? She uses a lot of garlic. Garlic is very important. I was surprised to read that um, that um, um, our past, our queen, um, prohibited onions and garlic because they had to deal with the public, I heard. That's, that was the, the, the excuse that it, um, dealing with the public and whatnot, it was prohibited to eat garlic or onions and I think that garlic is very healthy I take it in gel caps if I can't get to the real stuff I'm on the go I will um, take some pops of garlic it's, it's, it's an antibiotic it's good for the for the respiratory system your chest um, and it also lowers your blood pressure and even if your blood pressure is normal it'll keep it at a normal level so that is something that I always 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 have and i have more than that so guys here's the water that i told you that we go through okay but i'm gonna show you something else wait for it there we go guys ah we getting somewhere now haha <laughs> yeah it is doing the dang thing so we got three cases of water today of the bowling spring because i tell you this water does not get flaccid that one my daughter brought uh, a couple of days ago. She said, Ma, this water, I, 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 I was told, I asked questions. I said, okay, but uh, just to be on the safe side, this one. Oh, they had these gallons, guys. Not the ones that I have in the, where you could put the spigot. It's square. They're square. Um, they were like 10 no, $14 each. So next time I go back, um, oh, she brought toilet paper because... I stocked up on toilet paper for like a year and I was bringing all the stuff in and I didn't bring any more toilet paper in because I had all oh my goodness. But guess what? I got carried away. We were using it and we were down to two rolls and I wanted to fall on my behind, okay? Oh yeah. So wait for guys, I, sorry about the mess here, okay? I'm sorry about that. It's not even a mess. It's just that this room is not that huge. And um, so my daughter keeps the stuff as... Though that's one of my camera tripods. <laughs> but heck. Guys, my daughter lives off of this stuff, okay? She cannot go anywhere without this. She's got to have this in the car, in the, in the room... Um, uh, are these Clorox wipes? She's forever cleaning. 
Um, the lady, she's been reading the Bible. Okay. Um, oh, remember I told you I had two of these? I gave one to my daughter-in-law. I can't brought it from Florida. I got, she gave her my daughter one. And this is a little Bible that she keeps in her pocketbook. But for some reason, she must have, she's been reading, guys. This is my Bible. This is my Bible. But I share it with her. Okay. Yes. And it's more, it's more, I find this Bible more explanatory, though. It's the same. It's the same as the King James and all that. Yeah, it's the same, guys. Okay. So, let's see. What was she reading? Oh, okay. I know she was reading because, um, uh, the Psalms, the Psalms that I, um, that I was, had read, had been reading, um, were not in the 40, 40, anything. Okay. So, yeah. She's been reading. I, I, and I, I hear her listening a lot to Christian music lately. Oh, on her, you know, that boombox is, is loud. Let's see what kind is it. I think it's a JBO. If it's not a JBO, yeah, uh, yeah, it is a JBO. The name's inside this, this, um, this case. But anyway, guys, um, and look at the pandas, okay? And there's more pandas, okay? More and more pandas. Um, oh, she must have exchanged her coins, or uh, she saves coins there. She must exchange the coins or something, or put it somewhere else. Guys, there you go. You got two more cases of the Poland Spring. There's, uh... The uh, pure, the, oh shoot, what is it, 1122? What? Oh no, that's not good. Those juices are recently, they're from Amazon. I put them in there because I had, but I got to take all of this water out of there because the baseboard heater is right behind those boxes, okay? So that water has to come out of there. That's the reason why I stacked it on this side because it cannot be next to the heat. So guys... Let me show you some more, guys. Let's go move along here. Okay, guys. Sorry about the mess, but, you know, she ain't got time, but on the weekend. But she does keep, I mean, it's not a mess. It's just stuff that she uses and uh, her iPad and her re other glasses, reading glasses. And uh, her favorite blanket that I gave her has something of a daughter-mother saying. And um, there's my bulletproof jacket. Okay. Uh, guys, there's more stuff here. There's boxes, there's top, there, oh, there's the bag with more, more pandas and, and whatnot, okay. And as you can see, guys, um, I have boxes. I it's just said I took a little bit and just put it randomly so you can get a hold of something instead of going through everything. So remember I told you she has tons of this? Well, my other closet up in the front has more than this. So... And if you didn't know, they have the um, this the pancakes uh, in cinnamon. Okay, the cinnamon crunch. Yeah, they have now the pancake, the the pancakes. Okay, the pancake mix. And this tub is full of food, guys. Okay, and these are more snacks and more stuff in between, and chicken breast and uh, tuna fish, and hot cereal, quick cereal, bite of uh, water, all her milkshakes, and there's more and tons of more milkshakes all over the place, and yes, the, um, the soups, there's beef, there's chunky, um, and chicken, okay, um, yeah, I'm doing the thing, I'm doing the thing, guys, okay, yes, I am. Yes, I am. I've been. I've been working. I've been on it. I've been on it. Um, These are the uh, breakfast drinks. It's good to have, guys. Let me see if I, if I can move something out of here. These breakfast drinks, guys. Oh, my God. They're delicious. And they have a lot of vitamins, okay? These are refried beans. Okay, we got tons of that. We have a lot of the uh, biscuit mix, okay? In case we can't get any bread. Well, we have an alternate. And this one has garlic, guys. Cheddar garlic. So I have tons of this also stashed away in containers like this one. There's the, there's another breakfast milk. Okay. I mean, stuff that's nutritious, okay? You have to think about vitamin-wise, too, okay? Not just if you don't have time for a meal. Um, Listen, 
You got 13 grams of protein, 21 vitamins and minerals, 3 times the vitamin D. You got calcium. Okay, everything the body needs, guys, give it to it. There is a, a purple bin is long. There is stuff in there also. Uh, what else is up here? Peanut butter, there's more stuff behind. Let me see. Let me show you guys. There's more stuff behind. What the heck is this? This is the landlord messing with that darn um, uh, fuse box. There's um, the almond milk, okay? There's almond milk back there in those uh, containers that you can uh, put away, okay? There's uh, vitamin water up there, you know, it's different flavors because she has a variety of different flavors, so whatever, taste buds, that, you know, she will grab it. So this is uh, the grab-and-go stuff, and God, I am so proud of myself. There she has a whole box of um, baby wipes, okay? Yeah, those are baby wipes. It's a whole box, guys. She went shopping the other day, and she brought back a whole box of baby wipes. If you run out of toilet paper, you see got baby wipes. But she uses baby wipes regardless of whatever because she cannot live without. And I taught them that. I taught them that since they were little. Um, to always keep baby wipes for the reason that you're squeaky clean, okay? You never know when you're on the road, something can happen. Um, I have bottles of sodas back there. I keep up with it. And here's some more snacks and, uh, applesauce. Okay, there's, there's more stuff back there. There's the uh, uh, boxes of Vienna sausages. Look at all the uh, honey bunches and oats in her in the oatmeal. I mean peanut butter um, Guys and what's behind the sofa y'all seen that one, right? I know um, So yeah guys Ada's doing the thing my daughter's doing the thing and If you come into the room or you look inside the room, you know It's, it's nothing is to the visible eye for some water and nobody comes here, so I don't have to really worry about it, okay? Um, so, that's that, guys. So, getting back to this, let me work on uh, the refrigerator. Let me work on the fridge. And then I'll come back out and finish my... my oh, I gotta sweep the front, guys. It's awful. Uh, guess what? The lady next door... The corner. Hold on, guys. Oh, yeah, guys. The lady in the corner... She swept the whole dead end, her area. <laughs> uh, when I got back from, from the shopping spree, um, I see everything is spotly clean up to where this complex starts. Whoa. <laughs> right where you park at is loaded with leaves. So when the wind starts hitting it, they're going to land back down here. I'm like, oh my goodness. So I'm not going to worry about it. I am only going to sweep my area, you know, the stair area, this area down here and bag it up so it'll it'll be clean. At least all the days that I'm not going to be here, you know, until all them leaves us. I mean, yeah, in a couple of days it'll be back again to the same. So anyway, I'm going to do the leg work out there before I head out. So I will catch you um, on my out of here, the gets out of here journey to go do some more leg work over at um, Upstate. Um, uh, when I get there, so I, I don't know when I'll get there, but I get there, okay? So you're gonna get there with me, so you it's gonna stay with me, right? You gotta keep an eye on me. Listen, Van Lifers, stay communicated because if anything on the road, at least, um, we know you're okay or whatnot when you hit the road. Some, you know, some Van Lifers get on the road and you, you don't know, you know, they're on the road, okay? You watch them, you follow them. You know they're on the road, but then you don't hear from them. You you know you never know. You never know. We don't want to hear no bad news, okay? We don't want no bad news. We already have bad news from one van lifer, and y'all know who she. I forgot her name. Um, uh, the one that they were searching for uh, in Florida to the Appalachian trails and all of that stuff, all the way from New York, uh, all the way with, uh, from the West Coast on the um, 
uh, country, uh, the whole um, uh, travels of the West Coast and um, back to the East. And you, you know, you know, uh, uh, Petito, remember the girl Petito? P P Petito, Gabby Petito. Okay, got it now. Remember, um, if you haven't, go back to find it somewhere because her YouTube channel is down now. But if you don't know that story, get on Google or get on YouTube and or, or Google or whatever and find out the Gabby Petito um, van lifer, okay, what, what happened to her. So even if you're not accompanied by anybody, um, stay connected. You have a channel, stay connected. If you're going to travel from point A to point B, throw a video out there. I'm going now to a, such a place because if anything happens, we can be of help of your last whereabouts. So keep that in mind when you go out. So that's why when I head out, I make a video. I'm heading out now. And I will show you some parts. And when I stop somewhere, I'll tell you I'm over here. I'm over there, okay, like I did today. I'm at BJ's with my my daughter and uh, my my daughter-in-law. Um, shopping, you know. I got home, so you know I already got home. Um, and you know I haven't left yet, okay. I'm not gonna tell you I'm gonna travel and do all this and and not say I left because you're you're gonna think oh Ada has to be on the road right now, y'all. Two or three hours later tonight this evening, you're gonna say Ada has to be on the road somewhere. It is in upstate New York, okay? God forbid something happened and I don't travel to upstate New York and I don't make another video for weeks. You, are you going to miss me? Guys, would you miss me? So, that's why I learned from that, to stay connected, okay? Um, look at what happened to one of our family channels, um, OTWP and Dragonflies. Go check up their channel, guys. They're very good content. Um, very good content. I love the heck out of them. And it seems like from so many channels that opened up at one time, their channel is, is there. And it is just growing, growing, growing because it is good content. It's stuff that we enjoy. It's fun time. It's bad times. It's good times. They were disconnected with no internet service. And we, I thought personally that they went on vacation because they were talking about a vacation some time ago. So I thought they had went away. I, otherwise, I would have hit them. But, or hit one of the other people on the channel to ask them, you know, have you heard of so-and-so? But no, I, I had no idea. I thought they was on vacation. So we never know. So it's a good thing that if you're going to travel... Say, I'm leaving now, okay, and load it up, where you headed to, where you at, and make a little video down the line, even if it's a little blog or something, you know, make a little um, eight, nine minute video, you know, I'm here at this place now, ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm headed back, now I'm in my van, I'm safe, boom, I'm driving, I got my seatbelt, let's go, okay, that, and, and that way we don't have to worry, people do worry when you get attached to other um, YouTube channels, okay, Van Lifers, Peppers, whatever your preference is, um, you worry, you worry, so let's keep it together, okay, let's keep it together, let, let, let's keep the group together, let's keep our people together, let's keep the friends that we have grown into to become families, okay, let's keep it together let's keep them informed of your points a and b and c and d until you arrive to your destination and then you say i arrived to my destination i am safe and then you continue on with your whatever you're doing and continue to inform us you know until you get back to wherever you headed next or whatnot stay connected stay connected okay like you stay connected to God, um, when you open the channel, you were to meet thousands of people, okay, thousands. So, if you have the thousands in your channel, that means that you are very well liked, okay, they like your content. 
Uh, I just started, you know, I haven't did uh, practically much because I'm too involved in the prepping and getting this house in order and all of the stuff and all my travels and my surprises that came around the line and everything just messed up. So, um, but yeah, I do take my trips, y'all know that. Um, whichever way I take my trips, I take you along with me, I'll let you know. So, when I get ready to leave, I will let you know. I'll come back. I'll say, I am out now. I'm in my van. I'm all set up. I'm going full. I'm in New Jersey. I am headed now. I'm in this town. I will take you along little bits and pieces until I arrive to destination. You know, okay, Ada uh, got to her destination, and you'll see content on my video from the journey. Um, I'm not going to say I'm leaving, and then I'm going to do what I'm going to do. And then decide to make a video of it three days later. For three days, you're not going to see me. Are you going to wonder, what wow, did Ada make it to her place? Did, well, Ada, have, have you heard from Ada? Well, she said she was, well, you know, and you're waiting for Ada's content. Whoa, 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 you know, it's interesting what she said. She, but Ada doesn't show up. So are you just going to just cross the page? Or are you going to worry? If you really love your people, you will worry, okay, like I do. If I'm on your channel, because I worry, I like your channel, I enjoy it, and I will continue to to catch. Sometimes I can't catch up with it because I go to sleep. Tin tin foil, shit. As in tin foil, you know, I think she sleeps all day and me up all night, or she works all day. I don't know. I can't. I can't keep up with her, but I love her dearly. Uh, TJ Preps, TJ Preps. I learned a lot from TJ Preps. Um, I started to watch a bit. Oh, I fell asleep. But at least I know she's okay. But I can always catch up later to the content. So, you know, uh, Lake Fairy. Lake Fairy, I'm sorry. You ain't even see, see me say hi up there, but I started watching your channel too. Um, I'm not started. I've been watching your channel. What? <laughs> yeah. Um, it's just that sometimes you get wrapped up in other things. But I always catch up, Okay. I was like, but I know you're fine. I know you're okay. <laughs> anyway, let's stay connected, guys, okay? So when you travel, keep your family on your channel uh, informed, okay, of your, of, of your whereabouts on your travels, please. All right, guys. Well, I ain't traveling yet, okay? So I'm home. I'm going to sweep outside and um, get a bite to eat because I'm hungry. Now I'm hungry. And um, and then I get my stuff prepared to load up in the van. And then I will let you know Ada is out. I will make a little vlog. Wah! I'm out. Ada's out. Okay, guys? So I'll catch you later. Thank you for watching the video. I'm sorry for the lopsided and all this. You know, i uh, carrying all this stuff. And I'm being hungry. Anybody will lean to the lean back. Lean back. <laughs> oh, my daughter texted me, guys. I got good news. My daughter texted me. Um, that she got the job. She got the job. I was like, which one of us is it curtain A, B, or C? So, I don't think it's A. Uh, maybe B, a 9, 911 um, police dispatcher. Or it's the, um, uh, something with investigations or some, some, something. I don't know. Something around there. Okay. Curtain A. Uh, it wasn't a, an, an option that she wanted. I, I won't even mention it. <laughs> but... But she's happy to text me and say, I got the job. Because everybody's leaving her job. There's, there's 15 people quit. Uh, 12 people already put in their two-week resignation. She went to um, uh, a dinner. Uh, they took one of the bosses to dinner. There's two bosses there. They took one to dinner. The other one's an a-hole. Um, and the one that is the most qualified is three times the a-hole. That's why people are quitting. So, um, I didn't see. They don't have no workers now. Who's going to take the money to the bank, guys? <laughs> Who is going to take the money to the bank now? Now, now the banks are going to be short. ATMs are going to be short. Uh, chain stores are going to be short. Um, everybody's going to be short in money because these people are quitting left and right because they got miserable people working behind the desk and they make it bad for other people. And you know what? My, my, um, a lot, all of them said when they went to she went to a dinner. Um, um, a group got together and took one the boss to dinner. Um, 
she said um, she will quit too if a particular person was supposed to take that supervisor spot because right now the person is a worker like her and the person just loves to just pass by you and just throw something stupid to the to the to the workers so if you do that for so many years um imagine being behind a desk where you have to go to that person for emergency why not oh my daughter's calling hold up guys hold up okay guys good news she's gonna be the 911 dispatcher for it's not this town. It's a town the heck up out of here. I'm glad it's a town the heck up out of here. <laughs> it's a nice, it's a big town. Um, it's a beautiful town. It's beautiful. Actually, my daughter-in-law goes to church up there somewhere. Yeah, I remember. I remember she mentioned the name up there. Um, it's, it's, it's about an hour from here, but it's beautiful. So I'm glad uh, it wasn't door number one it was door number two <laughs> and i thank god that that position well that specific area that specific of all fields have pension plans medical benefits like i had them okay <sighs> thank you jesus so i told her that i was gonna sweep outside congratulated her first she's so happy so uh, they congratulated her so she's hired ha! um she's very happy um and i'm more happy for her because she went to college for all that but she did not want to be in no part of curtain number one <laughs> so um so that'll be a door opener for her to move up because you do move up in that field so thank god for that guy so i'm happy i'm happy for her i'm happy for her so anyway uh, i told her what i was gonna do and then i'll i'll head out she said ma if you're gonna head out before five o'clock p.m i said well i know i probably take the garden state parkway to palisades park that's the way it threw me this way um I guess I'll do that way and wind up uh, in that road with no way to pull over to the side. She said, Ma, Ma, it's going to rain, and I don't want you out there in the rain. And um, that's it. Our kids will do with you what the heck they want to do with you. Um, but I can understand her point. She does all of New Jersey working. She knows, you know, I don't even know where the heck Palisade Park were as many years I've been in, in New Jersey. And she knows about every darn town there is in New Jersey, and backways, and all highways, and and everything. I've been, I've driven, I've been with her in the car, and I, I, where the heck am I at, Ma? Really? <laughs> How'd you get out here? And get, Ma. <laughs> it's because when they are, you know, her job, they be all over the place. So she said, Ma, you get stuck in Fort Lee, and I remember seeing the sign Fort Lee. Fort Lee. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Somewhere. But I, I winded up on the Cuomo Bridge. For, when I was coming back, I winded up on the Cuomo Bridge. I don't know. I don't know how I wound up. And I had to do turn and, and come back the other way and pay a toll and then figure it out. And then I got back on the road. Some road. I don't know. And then it took me to the Garden State Parkway. So I went through Palisades Park and be, uh, leaving from my bros down some road, down some I don't know where until I winded up in Palisades Parkway. Something like that. Probably says Parkway threw away some, something like that. And then it threw me onto the Garden State Parkway. And I was happy because then I knew where I was at. I was in New Jersey. And I know all of the Garden State Parkway. <laughs> so, guys. Um, or the Turnpike. One time it put me on the Turnpike. And one time it put me on the, on the, on the Garden State Parkway. R regardless, both of them, I know where I'm going. So, anyway. I just wanted to continue on the on the New Jersey Turnpike, past the town, and just keep going 15 hours, and I'll be more happy. <laughs> but anyway, guys, she said that after 5 o'clock, don't go nowhere, because it's going to rain, and the traffic that's going to come from Fort Lee into that, uh, it's a circle, and I don't know what, and I'll be stuck in traffic forever, bumper to bumper, 
and Lulu da 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 and it went wah wah girl for real are you serious yeah my if I have to, if you're gonna leave you gotta leave before listen I need a nap I don't care if I'm stuck bumper to bumper okay <laughs> I ain't no rush uh, will you get stuck out there well I, if I find a, if I'm too tired I'll pull over I have a bed. I have, uh, well, my bed will be the floor, but I'll sleep. I have a sink. I got a toilet. I have a stove. I got fuel. I got food, and I got water, and I got clothes. So, <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, mom is rolling on a home with four wheels. So she started cracking up. She's like, oh, Ma, I forgot your van is all hooked up. <laughs> but, but, yeah, but you're not going camping. It doesn't matter. I do the same thing when I travel to Florida. That's what I do when I get tired. I pull over. Ma, listen. Leave me alone. <laughs> so leave me alone. Leave me alone, okay? I'm too old to be scolded. <laughs> It could put me into some hot water. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'll catch you later. Hope you got a good laugh. And um, let me, I got to get outside, guys. I got work to do. I got to do the leg work. I got to continue to do the leg work. And you gapping here, I'm not going to get it done. So I'll catch you later, guys. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you have fun with the video. Okay, guys. <laughs> I did my best. I did my best. I put the olive oil right there in the corner because she'd be looking for the olive oil and um her bread there and uh i'm gonna take this i'm gonna start gobbling down that orange juice okay because i love me some tropicana guys and uh i'm gonna leave this here because uh oh my frosted flakes okay i'm gonna put my frosted flakes away and then i'm gonna uh Put, leave that there so she knows it's there because if I put stuff away she's not gonna know what's here so I have a, uh, a technique here that when I bring something I leave it out uh, especially because I will be traveling out um, I, 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 I let her know uh, you know and in, in here I put this this and that you got that that and that that and that way she knows otherwise this is what I'll do okay I'll pile it up one on top of the other and that way she knows what is here. So hold on, guys. The refrigerator gave me a run for my money. Yeah, -da! I made it happen, guys. See, I made it happen. So I put the water uh, up here, okay? This is her snack stuff, those chobanis and whatnot. She buys those things like the cases. Um, I put the waffles in the back. I put a one... Um, the, the corn of eggs on top of the waffle. I mean, yeah, the waffles. And then the French toast, I put it on the front. And then I accommodate it because I won't be here. I'm the one who uses the regular milk because she's lactose intolerant. So this is hers. Um, her, her, she loves her passion fruit juice. God, that's another juice that helps your blood pressure. And it's really healthy because it has a lot of vitamins, okay? Um, she likes guava pineapple too, but she's more into the passion fruit. And then she has her milkshakes back there that she takes to work. There's my, uh, pineapple sodas. I have a craving every now and then for soda. Uh, I left the, um, the buttermilk biscuits out there and my, and the food that my daughter-in-law brought last night. And then the other carton of the, the big 24 eggs on the bottom on top of the other one that cracked an egg. There's some apples, lots of stuff like that. So guys, I'm gonna take this creamer with me. It's either gonna be this creamer or the one that has the ice cream. Oh, that one is awesome, guys. If you if you find it, guys, take it, try it. Okay, yeah, it has an ice cream picture on it. So this one's oatmeal creamer. I'm gonna take that one with me on the road. Uh, let me know what I cannot hide the peanut butter because she will kill me. She will kill me if she doesn't find peanut butter. I'm a peanut butter freak and so is she. Where am I gonna put you? You know what? 
I'll put it up here where she can see it. <laughs> Guys, this refrigerator is about to bust out, but you know what? It's, um, oh, I cranked up a little bit the um, temperature, okay? Because I saw that the water is uh, kind of, you see how it is? So when you pack a refrigerator like that, you got to crank up the temperature. Otherwise, you're going to have some soggy stuff in order to keep those waffles fresh and the French toast you got, and the strudels. You got to pump that temperature up a little bit, okay, guys? So, yeah, yeah. You gotta fight with it, but it'll, it'll, it'll close. And then, look at the, the meat is almost already getting frozen. And now, when I crank that temp up, you know what that's gonna do. So there we go, guys. I made it happen. That one at least closes. This one keeps popping open, but it will stay. It'll stay. Here we go, guys. So, guys. And for now, I put the beans there, one on top of the other, on top of the water. Because she cooks with beans, too. She cooks beans, or rice, yellow rice with beans, or whatnot. So, I put it there because uh, I'm not going to go around searching for spots right now. Or And that way she knows, uh, while I'm away, because I'm not coming back tomorrow, or the next day, or the next day, or the next day, I, I don't know when I'll come back. But once I leave, guys, it's hard for me to come back home. That, that's the honest truth. Once I hit the road, it's, I mean, if it wasn't for my darn landlord that never made it here. Guys, look at this. Okay, look at this. I, I still have tape. I still, I still have, I, I put a better tape here to hold, so this is the fan. Okay. They don't care. They don't care. So my daughter-in-law uh, uh, texted me from Walmart uh, two weeks ago. And she said, hey, you, know, this, you think this lamp will work in your bathroom? I'm like, yeah. So oh, this little blue light here is this censored light, okay? It came on because I just walked in the bathroom. And this is what it is, guys. It's just a, it, it's battery operated, okay? It's battery operated and you can put whatever color you want to select. But I think the blue illuminates better um illuminates better um you know coming into the bar you don't even turn the light on so she brought me this light guys okay um i don't know what she paid for but she didn't want to take my money either um and it comes with the light bulb too so it, it lights up pretty good in here see it lights up pretty good in here so i just um i just uh, left it like that okay so there so he doesn't care guys look at that so i have to be on the safe side so i ran the wire behind there and then i plugged it into the socket and then this one it's unusable so yeah guys see how that light look at that light <laughs> ah, look at that light guys but anyway um oh her bread okay she'll see her bread and this was uh bj's um the machine said um they don't have no uh, uh, cash registers there, guys. There is no cash registers. Everything is um, uh, scan and go. Scan and go. I, I, I can't never get the machines right. So she helped me. I took everything out of the cart, guys. I uh, to put it on some metal thing that was on the side. And she came to me. She's like, what are you doing? I said, I scan this stuff. I never scanned a damn thing in my life. Except when I used to work for, you know, cashier or, or clothing department, they had to scan stuff for other people, but it's been years. So she said, no, you just take this thing here, it had a little pistol looking thing, scanner. You just got to scan. I said, I didn't know. I didn't know. But on the machine thing, it said, uh, you know, uh, scan your coupons. I'm like, what coupons? What are they talking about coupons? What coupons? Are, eh? You know. I didn't know either, guys. I didn't know either. So, when um, she said, I don't know about the coupons either, I said, oh, jeez. You don't get nothing on your website? No. You get on your website? No. I said, well, you should get notification because we're both on the card. So, anyway. Well, we left out of there. She helped me scan the stuff, okay? Um, so, uh, I saw this book. I saw this book. Wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. So I grabbed the book. I said, hold on, a smart saver, let's check this out. So, yeah, if you grab one of these books, okay, these booklets, 
There are coupons. Oh, hold on. Oh, they had a whole lot of that stuff. Okay, if you grab one of these books, and then you can cut the coupon out, and then, then that's where it says scan your coupons. That would be something from the book here, okay, that I will have to go through for next time. And, and then we save, okay, off of your purchase. Okay, okay, we're already saving by going to this. This is, they're very cheap, actually. Um... But I don't like going in there because I cannot deal with that cart in my back and all that stuff. So I know I'm gonna have to take some muscle relaxers for the next two days at bedtime. Uh, a half. I take a half. I don't take a whole. I I, I I hate I hate taking stuff. But I take a half because I know I'm going to suffer. So anyway, guys, um, that's it for today. I I did my 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 leg work today and later uh, oh I gotta go do some more leg work leg work but just to let you know guys I I wanted to show you the coupon deal in case you didn't know that there is a coupon saver book somewhere in your Costco I don't know I don't I never shopped on Costco or Sam Club I don't know which one actually I don't even know which one is cheaper but this one you have an option of buying single items or the bulk. And that's the reason why I like it, um, because I cannot afford to go into uh, Costco and buy the whole box. Unless it's the whole box like this, you know, which is a reasonable price. And it's, it's, there is a two or four packs of stuff in there. There's 12, um, I wonder if this is the boxes. Oh, yeah, they are the boxes. I thought they were the, the little cuppies that you put on the microwave. You know, this is a variety of three different, um, okay, it's okay for $7.99, you know, okay, that's fine. Uh, but I'm not going to buy this that comes like in a four box, and this that comes like in a four box. I don't have the money for that, but I can buy, you know, similar to this would be fine for me. Little by little, little by little, you don't have to do it all in one time, you could do it little by little. So... Some cookies are good. Oh, I'm going to have a cup of juice, and then I'm going outside. Guys, thanks for watching. Um, thank you for sharing your time with me. I truly appreciate it. And I will catch you later on, okay, guys? I'll be back.